All right, hey, good morning, everybody. It's uh, Broke Bo and old B Ryan one more time. Good morning. So we're getting ready. We got old Gatorina loaded out, and we're about to take off. So today we're out here at Greenleaf, as you can see on the marina there. Going to be a good day. Right now we had a, we had a little bit of chance of rain. Uh, it's supposed to be cloudy, but as you see, we got sun. It's pretty calm, and we're going to get out there and catch some fish. So wish us luck, and we'll see you here in a little bit. Silver, that word, Elvira. Okay, guys, sorry I didn't have this recording, but our first fish of the day, nice little crappie here at Greenleaf. <laughs> Barely fit the bait in his mouth, and he choked on it, too. Yeah, who figured? Crappie. On a, what'd you catch him on? Big old weight bait. Look at that, guys. Crazy. Pretty cool. Yeah, imagine that. Crazy. Oh, he got it going, didn't he? Good. Another one? Boy, he didn't strike out. Ah, oh, oh. broke off. I watched him come eat it too. Was he a big one? Nah, he's not the average pound and a half. Square bill, second cast. I knew I had to make a change. That's a good one. Yeah, that's pretty good. You're in trouble, Brian. You may be right. Here we go, guys. Check out those black spots on it. First bass of the day. See you later. I don't see any spawning signs. No, no red tail, no. Were you beating the bottom or were you? No, I was just cast out here in the open, right on the grass edge. <laughs> right out there. Oh. Keep it coming, fish, you keep it coming. If you start swacking them on a square bill, then you know what I'm going to have to do. This is a silent square bill. Ah, I see. Yeah, Brian, it's that six cents, five oh, I was telling you about the silent. Uh, yeah, that one right there. Yeah, I saw that. That's pretty. It's got orange on the tail, blue on the head. Yeah. It's the Crush series. Yeah. I knew there'd be one right behind that grass. All right, fish number two, guys. I get better about recording. I'm sorry. It's just they're so far in between man here we go see you later buddy uptown funk gonna give it to you don't you believe me just right boom 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 it's a fish man on a frog yes sir good job brian yes sir that's a good one. I 
All right, guys, Brian, we were talking about a frog and how cool it would be, so he put one on and threw it in and caught that one. Nice. Fish. That is awesome, dude. So you switch to a Cinco, first cast, get a freaking fish. He's, hey. He's, okay. Okay. I'll see. I told you when it gets hard, time to hook me. Told you when times get tough, you're tough to go with Cinco. You got that thing, Texas rig weightless? Yep. No, I'm trying to get him. Oh, there you go. I was falling all over the place. <laughs> Give me a second, I will. <laughs> Here we go. Little big guy. Yep. Yeah. Should have made this move about. Oh, left, left, left. There you go. About eight hours ago. Yeah. Did you get one? Uh, I got one Where's that? Where's that? Was it a bite? Yep. Oh, yeah. Day, all the shad yeah, I, that should be decent. You might murder him in here. This could get, this could get U G L Y. All right, guys. So Brian figured out the bite again. Purple Cinco. We switched, made the switch about 20 minutes ago, and have caught three fish within. 15 minutes and we caught five fish before that all day, all day. <laughs> so maybe we make maybe we get a couple more here dang not definitely not i mean we're we're moving but there's nothing i can do about that bro bo we don't have a what is it power poles or ipilot one day we will But we still make it happen, don't we? That's right. Good fish too. Yeah. Need some help? Nope. I think I got him. Yeah, this is That's pretty a good. One. Better fish. That's a good one. There you go, Brian. Good job, man. Thing. He's got the worm in his throat. A That's a nice fish. bass. He's got man. a little uh, red, yeah. little red fin. Nice one, dude. Very nice. Tie ball game. Tied up. Three, three. We gotta get going. Get him, get him. Oh, fish. Need help? Good fish. Yeah, come back there. Good fish. Oh yeah. Want the net? You got it? You need a hand? Nah, I got him. You got him? Okay. Two and a half pounder. Good job, man. The Cinco is on. Oh, that's a good one, Brian. Yeah. That's a real good one. Good job. Yeah. Nice bass. Good little guy. Good job, man. There you go. Tie ball game. Tied up. Four to four. <laughs> That's promising. That's a little better fish. Yeah, that was that was a good one. God, we should have done this a minute ago, Brian. Hey, but we still figured it oh. out. You know what? Yes, we did. Took a while, but we'd have a good. We'd have. We'd start to have a pretty good tournament by now. Yeah. Yeah, 10 pounds or yeah. so. Which on a day like this could have been really good. Yeah. Everybody else said they hadn't been attention. 
That, la that last one was really the first non-keeper, Brian, that I caught. Yeah. It would have been Cohen with that fish. Ball game, boys and girls, and there went another Cinco. Oh, now you're in the hole to me, Brian. I'm always in the hole to you, brother. That's a uh, just because you caught up. <laughs> I think I got some uh, brown worms in there. Oh, see how you are. <laughs> I find him a pattern that starts catching the fish, and then he's gonna do me like that. I'm a competitor, Brian. <laughs> I'm kidding. Me too, buddy. Deer alcohol real quick, Brian. That seems to help. Hippish. Come now, fish. Hippish. All right, hey, what's up everybody? It's old Broke Bo here. Hey, sorry we had to cut off right in the middle of fishing like that. We had a storm roll in and we had to get off the water. So, a little choppy, but I apologize about that. But we still caught some good fish today. Pretty good day. Again, we were on uh, Greenleaf Lake in Oklahoma, uh, kind of southern Oklahoma, right outside of Ten Killer. Uh, it's a pretty nice lake. It's not a huge lake, but it's fun. Uh, a lot of good fish. Um, you know, these are waters we don't fish on all the time, so this is kind of raw when we go out there we don't have a huge game plan we have a pretty good idea of what the fish are doing but we don't know we don't have our special spots on these lakes we're just we're just trying to learn so that's kind of exciting it's kind of fun going out there and actually putting something together and catching some fish and today as you see in the video brian figured it out that uh, the fish were really liking the uh, purple cinco we were using gary yamimato uh, purple cincos um, and it worked pretty good i caught one on a square bill on a crankbait couple on a swim jig and the rest were on the Cinco. Brian caught all his bass on the Cinco and one on a um, kind of a, a weight bait kind of deal. Uh, he caught a crappie. So I didn't get all the fish in the video. I apologize about that, but I did get as much as I could. Um, but I will tell you this, I really appreciate you guys joining. If you haven't hit the subscribe button, hit that. Um, it really helps me out um, because it makes me no money and I'm not sponsored. So it really helps me out guys. <laughs> But I am just doing this for fun, so uh, it, it is interesting. I'm sorry, I'm getting better at the videos. Uh, sorry if they're still not you know, professionally done. I'm doing all the editing, all the stuff myself, and I am learning and getting better though. So stick with me, and they're gonna continue to get better. Um, I've got uh, a couple more videos behind this one coming out. I'll be working on those, getting them out. And then I think the next lake we're gonna go fish is Fort Gibson Lake. And there's actually an FLW Elite Series tournament on that lake coming up here in a few weeks as well. And so if you follow that, we're going to give you some different footage of the lake, just us going out there fishing for fun. And then if you watch the uh, Elite Series, you can, you'll have an idea of the lake. So that's pretty cool. I'm also trying to get, get into the Marshall Service, so maybe I'll get out there and fish with a couple of these pros. Maybe I'll learn something from them and uh, be able to show you guys a little more. So. I uh, haven't released any instructional videos, guys. What we've been doing, we've just been going out there and fishing. 
um, and just sharing, sharing the fun with you guys. Like I told you at the beginning of this, it's going to show you a variety of lakes. So far we've done Old Mogi Lake, Sky Took Lake, Greenleaf Lake, now we're going to go to Fort Gibson and then so on and so forth. Uh, we'll always try to keep it different. We might repeat some, um, but we'll try to keep it fresh for you guys. So, Thanks again for joining. This is Broke Bo, and I'm signing off. Y'all have a great evening, day, night, whatever. Uh, there goes a car. I'm in my neighborhood because I didn't have time to close out the video at the lake. Apologize about that. I'll try to remember to do that. So, uh, Again, signing off. Broke Bo. Check y'all later. Bye.